Understanding the Contraceptive Sponge, a Guide. Hello everyone, today, we're diving into an interesting topic that combines health, science, and language learning. We'll explore the meaning of contraceptive sponge, an important term related to reproductive health. Whether you're learning English as a second language or simply curious about different contraceptive methods, this video is for you. Let's unravel the details together, ensuring that you can understand and use this term confidently. The contraceptive sponge is a form of birth control that is both barrier and spermicide. It's a soft, disc-shaped device made from polyurethane foam that contains a spermicide called nanoxanol 9. The main purpose of the contraceptive sponge is to prevent pregnancy by blocking sperm from entering the uterus and killing sperm cells. Using the contraceptive sponge correctly is key to its effectiveness. Here's a simplified guide. 1. Wet the sponge with clean water to activate the spermicide. 2. Insert it into the vagina, making sure it covers the cervix. 3. The sponge can be left in place for up to 24 hours and should cover all acts of intercourse within that time. 4. Removal is done by pulling gently on the sponge's strap. The contraceptive sponge offers several benefits. Immediate protection against pregnancy. No prescription required making it easily accessible, can be used in conjunction with other methods for added protection. However, there are considerations to keep in mind. It does not protect against sexually transmitted infections, STIs. Some users may experience sensitivity or allergic reactions to the spermicide. Effectiveness can be lower compared to other contraceptive methods, especially for women who have given birth. Understanding the contraceptive sponge also involves familiarizing yourself with related vocabulary. Barrier method, a type of birth control that physically blocks sperm from reaching the egg. Spermicide, chemicals that kill or immobilize sperm to prevent them from fertilizing an egg. Cervix, the lower, narrow end of the uterus at the top of the vagina. Polyurethane foam, a synthetic material used for its softness and absorbency, in this case, to make the sponge. Thank you for joining me in exploring the contraceptive sponge. I hope this video has been informative and helps you feel more comfortable discussing and understanding concepts related to reproductive health in English. Remember, learning new terms not only expands your vocabulary but also your knowledge about the world. Keep curious, and see you in our next video.